hey guys, what's going on? Um, I just wanted to show you something quick, just moving my body, something that I've thought about that I know a lot of people do this movement, it's called the crow pose. A lot of people know it as coming, bringing your knees into your elbows or on your triceps, leaning forward, bring your feet off the ground like this. Now, there's, again, every time we do something, we're feeling something inside our bodies. We're using different muscles to bring more muscles into the exercise to make uh, strength more effective, to make the exercise easier. A lot of times when people sit into this, they sink into their, their elbows or their triceps. Now, that's okay as you're progressing, but what you're gonna try to find and what you're gonna do is you actually want to think about pressing the floor away from you, from your scapula. So when I get myself into this position, I don't wanna think of just leaning forward and just hoping for the best or leaning into my arms. I'm using focused effort to push the floor away from me as I bend in. So not sinking into the floor, sinking into my elbows, but pushing up and that way when I come off, I'm strong. So I'm not sinking in like this, I'm pushing through the ground. And what you'll find is as you do that, you'll be able to bring your knees off, right? So another cool concept is when you're in plank, if you're here like this, keeping this position, pushing the floor away, if you can imagine going into downward dog, that you're still pushing through your elbows, driving through the ground, not just sitting back into the hips, and then almost even trying to walk up, keeping that pressure, walking back down. So again, I find a lot of people don't get enough pressure pushing through the elbows. If you do that, you're gonna find newfound strength, newfound ability to, uh, to move your body in a more graceful manner and to use muscles you never used before uh, and to explore, explore the body in different ways.